69X is a non-profitable music company supporting original music and raising funds for homeless charities. Hey there, this is Mandy from 69X and this is vlog show number 12. Okay, so the first artist that I want to feature on the show today is an acoustic blues and soul singer-songwriter from Worthing. Once met this girl called Mary Jane Just a scent of her drove me insane Well I can always tell when she's around When she's near words that are better sound This artist is called Sean Murray he is from Worthing in the UK. Um, this next song, or this song that I'm playing you now, is absolutely brilliant. I loved it. It's just got a lovely summer vibe and really like the lyrics. It's really kind of down to earth. A real good story to it. Sometimes she'd only pop in for ten. Okay, so this artist, on his Facebook page, it actually says that he started playing the guitar in 2014 um, when he broke his leg. And then it says in brackets, he wasn't being chased by ninjas. <laughs> Okay, so it goes on to say that he absolutely loves music. He loves working on his songs and helping others out with theirs because he can't get enough. Um, like I say, he's from Worthing. Um, he's recording as much as he can at the moment, actually, and he sometimes does some busking in Brighton. The questions get lifted, and if they don't, then they all get shifted to a different part of my mind for a short time, keeping questions held back to the worst time, and then they follow Okay, so that was. Sean Murray with that brilliant song Mary Jane. If you want to hear the whole thing, get yourself, like always, along to the 69X playlist. It's already on there. Um, and check out Sean's uh, YouTube channel as well and go and subscribe. Um, I just thank you as well, Sean, because um, I kind of messaged you last minute because I know you messaged me ages and ages ago um, and I just kind of got back to you today. So I really, really appreciate you getting back to me. And just to let you guys know, out there actually that um, he's writing and recording at the moment um, for his second EP um, which is going to be out later this year um, and he also mentioned which I wasn't aware of actually um, that he also does a lot of comedy um, between his sets and some comedy songs so I'm definitely going to look out for that love a bit of comedy smile a day and all that um, but thank you so much, Sean. Um, you're an absolute star. Everyone out there, please go and check out Sean. If you're around Brighton, you see him busking, go and have a chat. Thank you so much, Sean. You're an absolute star. That was Sean Murray. <laughs> okay, so the next thing I just want to mention is the amazing Damien Keys out there has written a book. It's called The Rule Breaker's Guide to Social Media. It's available on Amazon, Kindle, paperback. Um, and it's all about um, strategies and creative ideas for social media branding and marketing yourself and your band. It looks absolutely brilliant. I haven't got one so far because I'm going to pick mine up at the book launch, which is taking place this week. If you want to go to the book launch, if you get in touch with DK Management and they'll send you all the details, but get online, go and get yourself one of these books. Just honestly, great value for so much amazing information. So yeah, I'll put all the links below, but go and grab one of those books and hats off to you, Damo. Seriously, it's a real accomplishment um, to do that. And I think it's absolutely brilliant what you're doing. And yeah, 69X totally supports DK management. And I'm definitely gonna grab myself a rule breakers guide to social media. <laughs> Okay, so these guys are a pop punk band from Surrey. They're called Omnibus. They're also very, very good friends of mine and 69X. And they've been supporting me throughout the last 18 months. Seriously, just absolutely brilliant. They played the Crash event last year, which I put on in Brighton. And they also played on loads of radio shows. They've just been so brilliant. 
Um, but actually, these guys have most recently reformed um, and they've brought in um, a couple of new members to their band and they have brought in Ryan Monchow on guitar and Felix Belly on bass. Okay, so these guys have been working on some new material and um, they have actually got a new single um, coming out with a video on the 29th of June, um, which actually I seem to be in. Can you spot me? <laughs> Can you see me yet? There I am. <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to be hooking up with the guys anyway, and um, this week at Damo's book launch in Brighton, um, can't wait to see you guys, seriously, it's going to be brilliant. Um, and a massive shout out for a gig that they're playing in Farnham at the Plough on the 29th of June. So all the links are below as usual, I've been playing a little bit of their music there, go and check them out, Emnibus, brilliant band from Surrey. Okay, so I just want to show you a little bit of the interview that I did at Dirty Noise a couple of weeks ago. Absolutely brilliant. Will Tonish, you're an absolute star. Also, while I was there, I managed to capture some really good footage from a band called Anything But. I'm hoping to hook up with these guys, but here's a little bit of their gig, which was absolutely brilliant. Anything But and Dirty Noise. Hey there, this is Manny from 69X and I am at Dirty Noise in Brighton. It's absolutely brilliant. Just had the first band on, absolutely brilliant. Here's Will and this is... Jamie. Jamie. So these are the guys that head up Dirty Noise. So how are you doing guys? Tim, oh, Tim, get Tim, involved. Tim, Tim, come on Tim. Come on Tim, you ain't got to Come on, Tim, 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 I mean, it's, it's Jamie's studio, but like you know, we put on the night to make a, a good sort of ethical sort of yeah. camaraderie sort of community-based project. Yeah. yeah. So how long has it been going? Uh, we've been doing it for like uh, almost a year. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like, like, oh, month. Really? July is our. Yeah, yeah. We should make that into like yeah. so an anniversary, anniversary, shouldn't we? Yeah, yeah. definitely. <laughs> definitely <Let's> do. do. <laughs> so, so what else happens down here then? So you you do, do the like uh, rehearsal. <laughs> Bands coming through the week and stuff. Um, yeah. Also, like uh, quite a lot of young kids come in and they smash all the instruments. <laughs> stuff, not like breaking, but like oh, so the parents bring them down. They do that as well. <laughs> gain anything from it, yeah. doing it because we actually really enjoy the music, yeah. and it's not about like, like, yeah, just yeah. about having fun. And we were just talking about the kind of bands that you get mm. down here, so that was really nice work. I mean, yeah. was a band called Anything But? Yes, that's yeah. fantastic. Excellent, really good set actually. So, um, how do you kind of go about getting the band on board? Is it just all through Facebook? Or? Yes, it's, it's, yeah. it's, it's purely, basically through Facebook, and bands do message me personally. Right. Thank you so much for no having me. It's been absolutely amazing, and I'm looking forward to seeing the other bands. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, so, thank, thank you. Yeah, thank you. anyone out there that wants to kind of, you know, get on this lineup for this event that happens on a monthly basis, get in touch with these guys. Totally amazing. Dirty noise in Brighton. <laughs> Okay, so Mandy is very excited about announcing the next band, seriously. Um, these guys have been absolutely brilliant, messaging me, so supportive of 69X. Their music is absolutely amazing. Um, I also received a CD from these guys, which I've got here. And as you can see, I'm trying to reflect it, so I'm not going to tell you who it is straight away. Um, just absolutely brilliant. Here's a little bit from this band and then I'm going to tell you all about them.
Okay, so this band is called Spud Gun Assassins. I absolutely love this album. Seriously, um, I've been chatting loads um, with Tex, who's actually the vocalist of the band. Um, I love what they've done. It's just absolutely brilliant. They've got this um, this CD here, which has got on it, um, Believe in Me, uh, Fall When You Need Me, um, Let's Do It Again, um, What Do You Wish For, Blind, and Watch Me Fall. Honestly, absolutely brilliant. It's in my car, actually. It is in my car. Um, but just a little bit about the band. Okay, so a little bit about this band. Um, this band was formed in 2008, and in the band we have Tex Nash on vocals. Great name, Tex, seriously. This is such a good name. <laughs> then we have Graham Hutchison on guitar and vocals. On bass and backing vocals, we have Steve Swatton. And then finally, on drums, we have Graham Lynn. Now the band have achieved their own sound, honestly, I can absolutely say that. I am a massive fan, and apparently the saying is you're a spud chick. So yeah, I guess I'm a spud chick, but I absolutely love it, seriously. So in your bio, it says on there that um, the emphasis of strong melodies and hooks all songs are written, recorded and produced by the band, which is brilliant, I love that. Okay, so all of the songs on there, seriously, are just so, so good. I am loving this in my car. Um, tracks that I really like, um, well I like them all to be honest, but if I had to pick like one or two, it would probably be um, Watch Me Fall and Believe In Me. Absolutely love those songs, really, really good. But like I say, like all of them on this CD, Listen, um, you can actually go and check out the Spud Gun Assassins. Um, all the links are below. Seriously, absolutely brilliant. You need to go and check that out. CD, brilliant music, great videos on YouTube. So get yourself over there. Um, I've also got one of their videos on my 69X playlist. So go and check that out as well. Um, I'm definitely, definitely hooking up with these guys soon. But in the meantime, thank you so much, Spud Gun Assassins. Absolutely brilliant, love your music, rock on. We just want to end the show with an amazing band from Brighton um, that sent me a little message and also sent me over a track and... There's this bit of crumpet that likes to play trumpet. I don't know if you can read this. She lives just down the hall, she's over six foot tall. <laughs> She likes to shoot hoops, she likes more than ten scoops of vanilla She's got a dog that looks just like a chinchilla The dog is kind of lazy, the dog is called Daisy Well I'd like to walk her, I'd like to be her dog stalker And on her door she's got painted bright flowers Tall skyscrapers of ivory towers When she leaves she wears dark glasses that are made by Gucci Her perfume always smells of fear Tokyo, Japan, Paris, Munich, London, Moscow, and on to Milan. She gave me letters from Russia and parcels from QVC. Her name, between you and me, is Yoli. Okay, so I have reverted to the selfie stick once again, Darren from Leg Puppy, really sorry about that. Um, but you have been watching the 69X uh, vlog show. This was number 12. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, it's been truly amazing. Um, just massive thanks to um, all the bands that are featured and all the artists that are featured on the show today. Um, absolutely brilliant. And thank you so much once again for your continued support. And see you next week. <laughs> 
Now this is my studio, um, as you all know I kind of built this myself um, and yeah that's kind of, that's a camera that's just run out of battery um, and that's all my notes um, that take me ages figuring it out. Um, that is uh, a cat, um, that's me in the mirror and actually I just want to show you this, this is a blackboard that I have in the studio um, and everyone that's been in here um, so far has put a little message on my board which is absolutely brilliant, I absolutely love it. Um, I've got loads of other messages actually which I posted on Facebook a little while ago um, but I just wanted to show you some of these messages um, and I truly truly appreciate all of your support guys out there um, it is absolutely brilliant and it defo keeps me going on a daily basis so thank you so much Okay, so the first artist that I want to feature... See, this is what happens. See that? There's messages all the time. Ding! I need to turn that on mute. Sometimes I do question <laughs> my own sanity. And the first artist that I want to talk to you about today is a singer-songwriter. That's a cat. That's a cat, right? This is what happens. Can you hear that, right? So, um... The cat um, has these little annoying things that he does and um, he, he won't come into the studio but he will sit outside the studio and he taps the door all the time. So I'm recording this and the cat's tapping the door. <laughs> Seriously, my animals are so high maintenance. Like, there's a cat down here. So I've got a cat here, there's a cat outside there, there's another cat over there with cats everywhere <laughs> then there's four chickens <laughs> four naughty chickens <sighs> mandemals <laughs> that's what they're called mandemals